cosmetic enhancement over here I want to try this uh, titanium uh, exhaust manifold bolt 12 point it's very light my only concern is, is the uh, the retaining function of this uh, nut I hope uh, it won't come off because it's really really loose unlike the uh, OEM one which is uh, it has a retaining functions that uh, when you uh, put on a stud it stopped right about three quarter of the way and that's the function of that retaining uh, to retain the uh, the tightness of it I hope it's not one of those like on uh, that you found on V8s that keep coming loose I'll find out I guess or something that uh, it requires some Loctite when I'm uh, when you're putting this on but I want to give it a try so, so I just have to remove uh, all this stud Just thought I would, I just want to give it a try. And to remove the uh, the existing studs is to put a two nuts on there. Last thing I want is this thing to, uh, to break on me. And I have a problem in my hand. Them up easy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I got uh, seven to go. And I'll be back. give it a shot. Nah. Okay. I think it's really much on there. One bolt I shared. So now, the last 30 minutes that video I would have is how to drill a broken stud, exhaust stud. My, um, where's my, uh, oh, this is how to remove a broken stud. Alright, I got that thing started. Huh. Still have a long way to go, but uh, it's been a time. Okay. Better to do it with uh, either slow or medium speed. I like to go too fast. We ended up uh, stalling the, the drill bit.
That's what I need. More wood. Of course, no. Let me put some marks before I go through. Slow speed. That's a hollow. All right, so that's the condition of it. So now I'm gonna use the EC out. Man, I hope I can get this thing off. If it, this thing would not come out, I'm just gonna go and keep drilling it till it goes just barely touching the uh, the helicoil man but I don't think I'll I'll be able to I feel like I'm, I'm uh... hey <laughs> what do you know Right there. Peace. Right on. Well, folks, that is how you remove a broken stud. Now, if the motor is in the engine bay, I'm going to say good luck. <laughs> no, you, you can still do. It's still doable. I got lucky. Oh man. Oh shoot. No wonder it feels like it, I said it's hollow. <laughs> okay. All right. So, guys, there it is. Right. That's how you remove a broken stud. Hope you guys like this one. I, uh, I don't like it. I don't like something that will break on me and then I have to uh, deviate from what I'm about to do. So anyway, here it is. Oh, I got to repair that too. Oh man. All right, so that's another blog. Okay. I don't know. I'm not sure if I, if I have some, uh, some leftover. Helicoil. So let's go back to normal programming. And this one. It has you. I don't know what size of a uh, Allen wrench this thing is, but what size is that? Number three. It's number three. It requires a number three Allen wrench. And you just thread it on there. Alright. Give it a little. It's good. Alright, so here it is, and we're gonna give it a try. Yep, any, anybody have a hub? Uh, does anybody have one of these on their cars and no issue of this thing loosening on you? You can make a leave a comment or something or not I guess I'll find out soon I guess I'll put either put a Loctite on them or something 
tank just for the hell. Some are too tall and some are too shallow. Yeah. Something I have to work it out. But I just wanna give it a try for now. And then when I put the motor in the engine, then I'll figure something out. Looks good though. Some is uh, sticking out and like this one here, I need to uh, drive that thing all the way in. It's either the manifold that I need to elongate the holes a little bit. But other than that, it looks good. Yeah. Just uh, another enhancement. Well, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys back on the next episode. For all my new subscribers, welcome. And I hope you like uh, watching some of my videos. And hopefully it'll help you out in some other ways. Other than that, right on, man. Again, thanks for watching. Next episode. Bye-bye. Almost there. Just picture that thing on that chassis, man. Yeah.